In this video, I'd like to answer question 3.3 .3 to 3.5 in the Grade 12 um, Paper 2, September 2023. The first question, 3.3, .3, asks for the name of the intermolecular force that is responsible for the observed trend in the boiling points. Now, propanol has the weakest uh, intermolecular forces, where pentanol has the strongest intermolecular forces, according to the trend in the boiling points. Now, although all three molecules will have dipole, ha, um, special dipole-dipole forces called hydrogen bonds between them, the strength in the hydrogen bonds are not changing in the molecules, but as the molecule becomes longer and longer, the strength of the London forces becomes greater and greater. So, it's um, the London forces become stronger as the nonpolar part of the molecule becomes uh, bigger. So. Question 3.3, .3, the answer is London forces. Then question 3.4 gives us um, three boiling points. It gives us 108 degrees Celsius, 129 degrees Celsius, and 149 degrees Celsius. And they ask which one of the three temperature, temperatures is most likely to be the boiling point of 2-methyl-butan-1O. So to answer this question, let's draw out the um, structural formula for 2-methyl-1-butanol. So this is butanol, and 2-methyl means the methyl group is on the second carbon, away from the carbon with the hydroxyl group. So the 2-methyl butanol is a chain isomer of pentanol. So, the, and it's one pentanol, sorry. So the 1 pentanol's boiling point was given as 138 degrees Celsius. So if pentanol has a longer chain than the 2-methylbutanol, it means that the London forces between the pentanol molecule will be stronger. Because the chain length of this molecule is shorter, the London forces will be weaker. So the, uh, this isomer of pentanol can't have a boiling point that is higher than the boiling point of 183 degrees Celsius. And it won't have a boiling point that is less than butanol's boiling point because the, uh, the molecular mass of the 2-methylbutanol is higher than the molecular mass of butanol. And therefore, the boiling point that you need to choose from, the three boiling points that we need to choose from, must be greater than 108 or 117.7 and it must be less than 138. So the answer to this question is 129 degrees Celsius. Now technically I have explained my um, answer but let's go for question 3.5 they ask us to fully explain our um, answer. So here we need to we need to mention that um, the boiling point of the two methyl Burton 1 all
is higher than that of butanol because it has a higher molecular mass. The London forces between two methyl buton one or is stronger then so we technically um, explained our choice by referring to the boiling points the, we need to compare the boiling points we need to compare the molecular mass and we need to compare the strength of the intermolecular forces sorry I'm going off the screen here my humble apology okay then for four marks we need to also um, explain why we didn't choose 149 as the boiling point so technically to methyl I'll go away. Butanol has a shorter chain length than one propanol, a uh, pentanol, sorry, pentanol, and therefore the London forces will be weaker than the London forces between pentanol molecules. So, the boiling point will be less or lower. Right, um, I know in class we explain the energy required, but in the memo, um, nothing about energy required was mentioned. So for two marks, you, for four marks, you have to compare um, the butanol and the two methyl uh, butanol um, molecular mass and their London forces. And then you, for another two marks, you need to compare uh, the two methyl buton one all to the uh, pentanol, pentanol one alls. Uh, boiling points.